Hi, so good to see you. Join us for a heart-to-heart -heart chat about a life guided by joy, peace and compassion. We are Vegan Heart to Heart. But animals are only killed when they had a long and fulfilled life. Better to kill and eat them than let them get old and suffer. Would you like it if someone made this decision about your life? She had a nice long life now. We better kill her now before she gets sick and dies? I guess not. Actually, animals are artificially being bred and fattened up as quickly as possible so the highest profit possible can be made of their flesh. All animals consumed today are still babies and are killed many years before their natural lifespan is over. Really? Oh my god! Male chickens are killed right upon hatching as they are useless to the egg industry and it would not be profitable to raise and kill them for their meat. Whether they are labeled conventional, organic, grass-fed, sustainable, humane, free-range or otherwise, they all end up in the slaughterhouse at the same age. Veal calves are killed after 1 to 24 weeks. They would live 18 to 25 plus years naturally. Chickens are killed after 5 to 7 weeks and they would live 5 to 8 years naturally. Turkeys are killed after 4 to 5 months. They could live up to 15 years. Pigs are killed after 6 months and they would live 6 to 10 years out in nature. Lambs are killed after 6 to 8 months. Their natural lifespan is 12 to 14 years. Beef cattle are killed after 18 months. Their natural lifespan is 18 to 25 plus years. Chickens, the egg layers, are killed after 1 to 2 years. They would live 5 to 8 years naturally. The pigs that are used for breeding are killed after 3 to 5 years. Their natural lifespan is 6 to 10 years. And dairy cows are killed after 4 years when their milk production drops. And their natural lifespan is 18 to 25 plus years. Mercy and compassion are certainly not part of a business plan for animal breeding and killing operations. Thanks for watching. For more episodes, please subscribe, like the video and follow us on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter. Compassionate listening and education goes a long way. Don't forget to be the vegan you wish you had met before you went vegan.